Hello, everyone. Welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in. I appreciate it. So today we're going to do something a little bit different because I've been asked by a lot of people if we can do something for all those folks in Hawaii that have been so devastated by these fires. You know, the footage that's coming out is just stunning and not in a good way. You know, it's it, I, I'm sure you've all seen it and I know most of you are very sensitive, so I won't get into the details, but you know, when I saw the interview with the governor, uh, a mayor, you know, it, it's, it's heart wrenching, isn't it? So as light workers, what can we do? Well, one of the things that we can do is make energy balls. And this is something that I do for my loved ones that I do for the planet. Sometimes I do it for my town, you know, whatever needs it. Um, you know, when my school system here in my town, and I don't have children, but you know, they was going through a lot, I was doing it for the school system here. So let's go ahead and do this. If you've never done it, just follow along with me. So you're gonna do like a little visualization. Now, for those of you that aren't great at visualizing, if you can't see it, sense it. So imagine, put your hands in front of you, that there's a waterfall in front of you and your hands are just being cleansed and bathed by this waterfall. And just feel the water cleansing and purifying your hands. Rinsing away any impurities, anything that's negative, anything you don't need, anything that's not for the highest good. Just raising the vibrations of your hands. And now take a moment to look at your hands and appreciate them and just say, thank you. Thank you hands for everything that you do for helping me to eat and drink and to write, um, to help me move last weekend. Everything that our hands help us do, hold our loved ones, pet our cats and dogs, you know, everything that our hands do. Just say a thank you and mean it. Feel it coming from your heart, like a heartfelt thanks. And now you're going to start to rub your hands together. Now you can rub them back and forth. You can go this way. You can go in circles. I like to change it up. I do all of the above because I want to get it warm. I want to feel some heat. I want to get that friction going. So really rub it because we have chakras in our palms, right? We have chakras in our palms. So let's get those chakras activated. Let's activate our chakras. Imagine beautiful white light is coming out of them. Warm those hands up. Now, make like a ball. Feel the heat, feel the energy between your hands and start to play with it. Start to play with it. Start to feel the energy, just maybe growing a little. See if you can grow. See if you can push your hands further apart. See how far you can go before you lose the energy. And squish it in a little, feel it squish in a little bit. If you start to lose the energy, rub your hands again. Now let's imagine that in the middle of this ball, we place Hawaii. We place all the people that live there, all the Hawaiians, the wildlife, the pets, the trees, the flowers, every and any living being that is in Hawaii, that has been affected. And just feel all this white light going all around them. You're just saturating them with love and light. Give them compassion, give them that love, heal them. And imagine that it's going into each person, that this light's going into each animal, each tree, flower, their fruits and vegetables, everything. 
Everything was so affected. But we're just sending love and light. And I ask that the angels come in. In particular, Archangel Raphael to come in and to heal Hawaii, everyone that was affected. And just imagine that they're all in this fall and Raphael and his team of healing angels are right there, all helping. And if there's any extra energy, we just ask that it goes out into the world where it may do the most good. And we thank creator, source, God, whatever you call that energy, Raphael and his angels for being with us and for helping us to heal every Hawaiian that has been affected and the land itself. And then shake your hands off, get rid of that energy. <sighs> and then, you know, because I know some of you will want to know, like, how often can I, you can do this as often as you like, as often as you feel like you have energy for, you know, so if you feel like you have energy to do this a few times a day, do it a few times. If you want to do it with friends and family, you can do that. If you want to do it for your friends and family, you know, I always do this for my cat Annie when she gets sick. You know, I always imagine her in that ball. So, you know, you can put your house, you want to keep your house safe, your car safe, your workplace safe. Put your house in there, right? So we can use it for Hawaii, but we can also use it for other things in our day-to-day -day lives. So I hope that this was helpful to everyone. And let's just keep, you know, all those Hawaiians um, in, in our hearts and in our minds right now. All right, my friends, thank you so much for joining me and I hope you all have a beautiful and safe weekend. Bye.